Hello all, in this video we are going to make the simulation on clevis pin assembly. So first of all you have to open your uh, ANSYS workbench and go to static structural. Okay, after it will pop up this table and go to table. Our material is structuralistic. We already said the engineering data. So go to geometry. Uh, the geometry uh, for this uh, project I already made here so if you want to make uh, this uh, this uh, pin assembly so you can visit my Katia playlist guys so no problem I already uh, uploaded the video uh, there with uh, explanation so there is no problem hopefully there is I hope there is no problem will occur to make this uh, design so now go to generate it will take some time okay after going to here you have to go import external geometry i already save this file in stp file so here click clevis pin assembly dot stp and go to generate so it is in frozen view so to view in a solid line type form this is our Mm, assembly okay you said I'm giving the rename this is yoke this is you say but this is rename this is pin okay no problem guys okay here after importing the data okay sorry you have to go your access workbench now go to model okay it will take some time okay this is my pin assembly okay guys now geometry okay pin have to us assignment means this is structural steel structure some of you have already selected the structural steel so no need to do this explicitly but in my pc it will uh, i have to do it explicitly by my by by my myself guys so no need to see this axis axis is here and now connection in uh, ansys it will uh, automatically generate the, the contact type so guys if you want to generate your own contact local contact your own contact then what you have to do is go to connection okay right click on it delete on it okay now i'm going to generate my own contact so manual contact region now what is contact and target body and generally the contact body is less stable than the target body so always uh, kept in mind keep in your mind that contact body is always less stiffer than the target body so in for this i am taking as a contact body in u shape so i am selecting ok now it is visible as a target body i am selecting ok no need to i cannot do it so first of all select this one ok now cancel it select this one and hide body ok guys now select this one and this is my what target body okay and right so all bodies now i have to hide hide body now i'm going to select this one as a my contact body guys because in this my material is not different 
they are uh, st structurally still but sometimes it is uh, if the material if the uh, material is of different type then you have to do uh, uh, then you have to select what is contact body what is target body explicitly guys so after doing this you have to we are working on no separation bonded contact type so no problem guys okay okay then again go insert manual contact in this in this i will rename it as a manual contact with okay with yoke yoke and pin okay guys now yoke this is an yoke i will select this one and right click head body and click this one as a head body now i am zooming in it so that it will visible to me place and um, press control and select this two whole circle okay it is selected for the whole contact type so this is contact body okay guys so i am selecting this was as a contact body now see all bodies now this is as a my target body okay guys this is my target body and apply so again i am going to generate another contact type manual contact it is the contact between i will give rename it this is the u shape and pin and i am selecting this one and this one as my target body and my contact body is select this one and hide it select this one and so all bodies okay hide body now i'm also hiding this one hide body now i'm selecting this this one and this is an contact body okay so now this is my contact and i'm going to return my so all bodies okay now this is my i uh, i uh, define my my own contact on this so you can see guys this is the contact between it will show you guys what is the contact this is the contact u shape and yoke this is the contact okay this is the uh, contact body here you can see contact body this is target body so no problem guys and go to mesh right click on it generate mesh okay okay guys here is an one mistake i made this is not a bonded type contact type it is it must be separation we are working we will uh, see what is the how separation um, will do the uh, this uh, simulation and separation bonded okay guys no problem okay after mesh okay i will just go to relevant relevant center is not course it is fine guys again i am going to here and go update okay guys here you can see this is our mesh and static structural insert and the uh, we are taking uh, in this simulation we are taking the pressure the pressure is acting in this part and it is of one okay i'll select the unit okay okay normal to it is selected here okay it is in this it's by default unit is in mega pascal so it is mega pascal guys no problem pressure now geometry okay 
now it is acting inward guys so I want it as a outward so I have to give this in minus and no problem now it is showing me outward guys here you can see so ok guys no problem here now go to static structural again go to pressure fixed fixed support the fixed support is here this one apply ok no problem go to solve here we the we do uh, what what we give the local meshing how to give local meshing by your own manual local meshing so you have to know about this if whenever you, it required um, the answers by default gender the con uh, region uh, contact type but sometimes uh, we have to make our own contact okay so this solution is here now I am going to this part insert stress we are observing on it maximum stress ok guys deformation stress maximum shear stress ok we will take one miss misses ok stress and I will take insert deformation deformation uh, deformation I will take directional deformation here the deformation will occur in this is in x direction guys so the deformation is higher than higher in x direction guys so x axis is already saved here if you uh, don't have uh, x axis already here so you have to change it so now go to solve ok now this is my simulation on on the clevis uh, pin assembly so guys if you want to see okay yeah, this is in directional strain okay what is the equivalent strain or to scale true scale okay auto now you can see that maximum stress where is the maximum stress okay I will just this is the maximum reason where stress is maximum this core part so guys what is the directional so directional four point 0.411 okay this is the maximum deformation in mm so guys in this way you can uh, uh, you can do your uh, simulation analysis so uh, another thing i want to say that if you want to generate your review uh, pre-port on it okay it will take some time now it will generate okay guys no problem here so you don't find any option here download how to download here and here i see this and after seeing some time i found that here there is a send to and you can send to in microsoft word in this way you can save it and okay it will automatically generate your on microsoft okay i'm going to save okay i'll give the name also it will take some time guys okay, I again click save otherwise I will go here ok save ok it will my I'll save as ok save as mechanical report on clevis okay guys okay now I saved it now I don't want this one also so thank you guys I already I told one more thing that how to uh, generate Microsoft Word file okay reboot 
सो थैंक यू थैंक यू ऑल गाइस लेट्स मीट टू द नेक्स्ट वीडियो थैंक यू इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब